हेलो एवरीवन वी आर बैक विद स्क्रमशियस चिकन कोरमा रेसिपी ट्रस्ट मी गाइस दिस इज सो गुड लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड विदाउट वेस्टिंग एनी मोर टाइम टेक 750 ग्राम्स ऑफ चिकन क्लीन इट एंड लेट इट सोक इन विनेगर फॉर 15 टू 20 मिनट्स एड टिमरिक एंड वन एंड हाफ टू टी स्पून ऑफ रेड चिली पाउडर सॉल्ट and 1 and 1/2 teaspoon of ginger garlic paste use fresh ginger garlic for the best results mix everything and let the chicken marinate for 30 minutes to 1 hour in pressure cooker add 1/8 cup of oil and add 2 cups of onion and to fry them till they turn golden brown and some salt Here is the tip: If you have time, please fry the onion and use this fried onion to marinate your chicken. Even if you are making biryani or korma or anything, अगर आप chicken को marinate करोगे fried onion में, that gives a really nice flavor. My onions are frying. Let's prepare the masala. Taking one medium-sized tomato and one fourth cup of curd. little less than half a cup of fresh coconut and homemade garam masala 2 teaspoons and always add uh, sunflower seeds or watermelon seeds instead of kaju or badam if you are making korma that will give you a nice texture and taste especially sunflower seeds i'm adding 5 to 6 badam and 3 kaju make a fine paste and keep it aside my onions are turning brown now i'll add my chicken and uh, roast it for some time Cook this on low medium for five minutes. I'll just cover it up with the lid. So I want to let it cook in its own water. Chicken will lose out the water. The garam masala I usually prepare at home. So these are the ingredients I have used. Just triple the amount of ingredients I am going to show you right now in the video. dry roasting three long two green elaichi one big elaichi bit of cinnamon stick and bit of chapatri one teaspoon of zeera and i'll be adding uh, dhania in the end because i have switch off the flame and added uh, one tablespoon of dhania powder and then uh, 1/4 teaspoon of nutmeg powder to it and just wait for a second For our chicken korma, we need uh, two teaspoon of garam masala, right? So all you have to do is triple the quantity of the ingredients I have shown and uh, dry roast them. Add it to your tomato paste. It has been four minutes. I am going to just mix it and let the chicken cook again for three to four minutes. this masala to the chicken and let it cook for 5 to 10 minutes on high flame after 5 minutes add bit of water and pressure cook for 3 whistles now add a handful of coriander leaves also add 1/4 cup of milk and mix it well and let it cook for 3 to 4 minutes Our yummy scrumptious chicken korma is ready to eat. Goes well with paratha. Finger licking good. Trust me. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel. Bye bye.